Good morning. Today is Friday, December 4th. Um, we are going to look at drawing conclusions and a contraction review. And then you need to reread the story, The Gardener. And then there's the selection test included in here. Okay. Um, when you do the selection test, be sure when you answer those last questions, you answer with complete sentences, capitals, and periods. Okay. So looking at today's page about drawing conclusions. So a conclusion is a decision you reach that makes sense after you think about details or facts in what you read. Now sometimes when you're drawing a conclusion, you also think about things you already know. Okay, so you're using your prior knowledge and things from the story to help you figure things out. As you read, think about the details and make decisions about the characters and what happens in the story. Okay. So let's take a look. It says read the following letter, then answer the questions below. You're going to have to make some decisions on things from the story and things that you might already know. So here we have another letter, kind of like in Dear Gardener or in the Gardener story. Dear cousin Howie, we traveled all summer. We finally arrived here at the end of August. So they've been traveling all summer and they've gotten there in August. Wildflowers were blooming everywhere. The prairie has a beauty of its own. The prairie, I know the prairie is out west. Before snow fell, we planted bulbs. We had our prized tulips in the spring. You wouldn't believe the showers of rain we have had this spring. We plowed and planted the muddy fields anyway. I got so tired that I dozed off at supper every night. The grains are sprouting now. Can you come out and help us with the August harvest? Yours, Jonathan. Okay, so now what do you think you know about what maybe some background knowledge? that I know they're headed to the prairie. It took them all summer to drive. Would it take you all summer to drive out west right now? No, so I'm thinking that this is probably um, in the past. I'm wondering about maybe they were moving west for land. Um, they traveled all summer. They brought plants to, to plant. They brought their toilet bulbs. Um, they had to plant their fields, and he was very tired. So let's look at number one, using what you know. What are Jonathan and his family doing? So I've kind of already mentioned some things that I was thinking about. Um, I'm thinking they're moving west, like perhaps pioneers, and they're moving their family to start a new life out west. So I'm going to say they are probably, not to say it for sure, no, but I'm using what I know already. They are probably pioneers. They are probably pioneers. Oops. Oh, shoot. Moving out west. I might add moving out west to take that out of there. Out west to farm. Okay. Capital period. All right, so number two, how do you know that cousins Jonathan and Howie are close friends? Does it say they're friends? No, it doesn't really say that, but would you write to somebody and tell them all about what you've been doing if you weren't friends? He's, he, Jonathan is writing a letter to Howie. He's telling him all about their trip, and he even at the end asks them to, asks them to come and maybe um, help with the August harvest. Okay, so how do you know cousins Jonathan and Howie are close friends? Um, they, I know they're friends. I know they are friends because, right? Ugh, not much room to each other. I could add also, um, even ask them to come out and help. Okay. So, 
go ahead. I want you to go ahead and read through the, the next three and do those. This one down here says, how does the text structure, text structure, this text is a letter, okay? Help you know that the two cousins live far away. All righty. Um, the next page is about contractions. It's just a review of what you've already been working on. Okay, so use each pair of words to make a contraction. Write the contraction on the line. So have, not, would be haven't. And down here, use the word in parentheses to make the contraction to complete each sentence. Write the contraction on the line. Judy has not planted a garden before. Judy hasn't planted a garden before. All right, let me know if you have any questions. Have a great day and make sure you are reading each night too. All right. Bye-bye.